You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week, and I'm playing more PlayStation games on the PlayStation Classic via RetroArch. And this time, I'm playing Bust a Groove. For those who don't know, this is a rhythm game where you have your characters dancing. And it's a Simon Says kind of thing to follow on-screen instructions. So it's not exactly... Um, I mean, it, do it doesn't actually play like Dance Dance Revolution. It's quite different. But it's interesting, actually. Uh, I did play this a lot back then. For some reason, I guess uh, rhythm games were kind of new to me. And Dance Dance Revolution wasn't even released during this time when this game was first released and let's see if um, how this p goes on the PlayStation Classic I mentioned that because I suppose this could be a good test how laggy the PlayStation Classic can be because you need to be good with your timings here and if your timings are bad, you'll probably not do any of the dance moves. And uh, if there is lag on the controller, then you'll probably not be able to do any dance moves. No matter how good you are at following what the screen does. Uh, let's see. Uh, I apologies if I might end up being silent. Because you really need to focus on the timings, actually. Alright. I can already tell. This is not really working out. I'm pretty sure I'm getting the timings, but it's getting a lot of misses. It's not registering. And this one I'm confident to say I blame the lag. Maybe because it's on HD, I'm not getting any of the timings. No way, this is impossible. I'm pretty sure I have my timings on this game, but it's just not happening. Wow, it's just not happening. Maybe I'll try another character. Maybe the song was too fast. But no, no, I'm pretty sure I got the timings here. I, as I mentioned, I played this game a lot. So yeah, I can see that I have to press a little bit earlier than the, the proper timing. No way! Yeah, you really have to be earlier on the timing. 
and being too early can still make you miss your moves. It's kind of hard if you don't have that guide. Timings will be really be messed up. So uh, I suppose it's playable with quotation marks, but you'll need to somehow relearn the game with its timings. No, no way. <laughs> I can't accept this. Nope, it's the lag. Timings are all messed up here, so I'll I'll see if I can load up the second game. I played that a lot as well. May that maybe that's where um no. Can't believe it. I shouldn't be able to do this. Yep, I'm getting frustrated. This, the timings are really different because uh, I don't know because we're sc scaled to 720p. It's digital things like those. So yeah, because of that, I cannot recommend this game to be part of your collection. Um, it could be just be my skill too. I need to relearn the timings, as I mentioned, if I want to play this on the PlayStation Classic. But yeah, if I'm pretty sure if you know the game and you've known the timings even before, you'll find this completely off. So yeah, I really cannot recommend it, unfortunately for us ba Busta Groove fans. Actually called Busta Move in Japan, but since that's already used for another game, that name they renamed it Busta Groove. Let's do this. Man. It will take a number of tries, but I guess you'll get the hang of it. These dance moves don't appear on Fortnite, though. Ah! All right. Sorry, guys. I give up. You really need to relearn the game for this one if you want to play it on the PlayStation Classic. But anyway, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching 8-Bit Days a Week. Please do like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video.